This is a very basic video to explain. I've replaced every team in the NBA with their all-time team equivalent, meaning this is a giant 30-team battle of the greatest players in league history. I've gone ahead and turned the salary cap off with the hope it encourages player movement. Either that or the rich might get richer. I'm very concerned the Lakers or Celtics might just end up breaking this video, but we'll see. The other wrinkle I've implemented is that all the key star players from the current NBA who aren't on 2K23 all-time rosters, well, I've put them in the year one draft class, baby. And I'm genuinely curious, just before we hop into the sim, what do the uh, power rankings, the Warriors, Spurs, Co oh wait, what the heck? Where are the Lakers? Yo, the Lakers have Magic, Kobe, <laughs> Aino in the 17. The Clippers have Kawhi, McAdoo. How are they the threat? That is weird. I mean, the Spurs, yeah, makes sense. Duncan, Robinson, Gervin, Kawhi, TP, Manu. Ooh, that, that is a gnarly roster. And yeah, the Warriors with 99 overall, Wilt, Curry. I, I, I do get it. I do get it. Also, the Celtics. If it's not Lakers, Celtics year one in the finals, let me just say, I will be surprised. Now let's get to it. Oh, what? Okay, maybe the power rankings knew what they were talking about. Wilt wins MVP meeting. The Warriors probably had an insane record. His numbers weren't even that good, bro. Willis Reed, six man of the year in New York. Okay, Scotty, DPOY, Zion. What? How do you win most improved player averaging 13 a game? That's funny. First team all NBA, T Mac, Big O, both LeBrons. Well, two of the three LeBrons and Will. Second, we got Reem, Dirk, KG, Clyde. Wait a minute. Clyde finally greater than MJ. Mike didn't even make 13. Yo, wow. What happened? What happened to the Bulls? Wow. All right. MJ and Scotty both on first team all defense. Dwight. Yeah. Okay. Dwight getting some love. Uh, two of the LeBrons here as well. Dwayne Wade. It's hard to tell much, but here is the playoff picture. So the Lakers and Celtics are indeed the first seeds. Okay. Like I projected, the Warriors, the two seed, the Spurs miss the playoffs. The Clippers are fifth from the uh, top of the power rankings. Actually, the East was insanely tight. The Celtics 57 wins were the one seed and barely five. Okay. The East was way Way worse than the West. If barely 500 is making the playoffs, the West 42 and 40 made the playoffs. I guess I, I I don't know. Maybe the league was just super balanced overall with these all-time teams, but the Lakers clearing away the best team. I'm very curious. Season one overall stats. T Mac, the scoring champ, averaged 26 a game, also averaged 11 assists. It makes sense that players won't have insane numbers because the lineups are so balanced. Clyde indeed with a killer season. For reference, the loaded Lakers team. I mean, just so much balance. Kobe did lead them in scoring. There's Shaq. There's Elgin, of course. Well, let's get to the playoffs and see if we've got any interesting scenarios. Okay, so the Lakers advance nice and easy. The Clippers with Kawhi and Paul George. The Jazz, Carl Malone, John Stockton, okay. And the Warriors with Steph Wilt. They made it. So the West is pretty chalk. The Sixers did take six games, but they beat Dominique and the Hawks. Yo, MJ got overshadowed by T-Mac in the playoffs. It's that, wow. MJ and the Bulls were the three seed. Oh, Mike averaged 18 a game. Yo, D-Rose is trying to backpack, but to no avail. And look at T-Mac. T-Mac 26. Yo, T-Mac just dominates these simulations. It's kind of crazy. They got a really good team, man. Wow. MVP Wilt is done, though. He got dusted by the Utah Jazz. Malone, Dantley, Maravich, Donovan, Mitchell. Yeah, that's a good team. The East is going down to the wire, including a game seven for our magic. And yes, I said our magic because I'm on board, T-Mac. I want to see you be great, brother. And it's a five-point game in game seven. We got to see T-Mac be great and close this team out. Yo, uh, oh my gosh. T-Mac isn't even on the floor for the magic. Oh, that's that's actually a good look. Oh, that's a really good look, Richard. Oh, he bricked it. He bricked it. You were wide open, Richard. Please don't tell me the Knicks are coming back. Oh my word, Walt Frazier cooking up. Magic are running the same set. Richard was wide open again, but Penny looked him off. That's a big time who. Ain't no way you let him get that position. Melo goes out of bounds. Hey, oh, Melo, I hate to throw this word around, but that was kind of a chill. The Magic are Cinderella's story, but will they get stymied by the historic Celtics? And unfortunately, looks like, yep. Looks like, yep. oh, the Ma oh, the Celtics and Lakers. I mean, I predicted it, but I'm kind of not happy to see it, Brad. This is a battle though. Lakers up 3-2. This is game six. Six. Oh yeah, I knew it. I knew the gosh darn Lakers. Oh, and I forgot Wilt's on these Lakers too. So Wilt Chamberlain winning MVP on one team, a championship on the other. It's just the year of the Big Dipper, people. Anywho, the Lakers did win the championship and Magic Johnson won finals MVP. Interesting. But here we go in the play. What? Jalen Brown went first overall. I don't know what I was about to say. Here we go in the draft. Jalen went one, Tyrese number two to the Hornets. Oh my worth. Shea went to Canada. That's perfect to the 
Raptors. I can't believe Shea lasted till third. Evan Mobley fourth to the Mavericks. Dude, LaMelo Ball is still out there. And there he goes to the Grizzlies. Uh, now let me say Victor Wembenyama is still out there. Cade goes six to the Bucks. Okay. And there goes Victor to the Nets. To play with Dr. J and Kevin Durant, that's going to be dirty. Player movement was indeed on fire in the offseason between year one and year two, resulting in Michael Jordan recruiting Prime Will Chamberlain and Lakers Shaquille O'Neal. The Atlanta Hawks went point guard shopping Chris Paul, John Stockton, and Kawhi and Anthony Davis. The Miami Heat still have LeBron, D-Wade, but they added, you know, Derrick Rose, Kevin Garnett, couple former MVPs. Giannis Antetokounmpo and Dominique Wilkins took their talents to the Big Apple. The Lakers didn't get worse. In fact, they added Tim Duncan. And the Warriors replaced Wilt Chamberlain with Patrick Ewing. I'm not sure if that's gonna work. Man, I don't know about this. Power rankings entering the season. The Spurs are still first. Yo, these power rankings are fraudulent. How are the Lakers still? Dude, the Lakers added that boy Tim Duncan. Yeah, it might be another lopsided top heavy year, but maybe somebody will dethrone these LA fakers, baby. Let's go. Okay, in season two, Oscar Robertson takes home MVP. Uh, Shane Gill just had, oh, he looks good in that Raptors jersey. Rookie of the year. T-Mac, six man. This is Rockets T-Mac winning six man. Okay. Shaq still on the magic winning DPOY. And there we go. Michael Jordan finally makes first team all NBA. Just one LeBron up there. All NBA second team, James Hart. Yo, the Rockets might be dirty. And all NBA third team, there's our uh, magic T-Mac trying to keep this all straight in my mind. Playoff pitcher, the Lakers, man. They're still the one seed. Oh, Rockets are only the eight seed. I thought they might be better. The Celtics slipped a tiny bit replaced by MJ and the Bulls. Yeah, he's coming back for his throne. Wow. Wow. Reggie Miller wins scoring title. I mean, he is up to a 96 overall. Him and Bob McAdoo of all people. Fair enough. Once again, the West was dealt with pretty quickly. The Spurs swept the Thunder. The Clippers swept the Blazers. And the Lakers did not get upset, unfortunately. Uh, the Kings into round two. Looks like MJ and the Bulls beat LeBron and the Cavs. Okay, the Knicks with Giannis. They are into round two. And the big three Miami Heat upset the 76ers. Wow. Oh yeah, the big three Miami Heat plus Derrick Rose plus Kevin Garnett. How are they only the six seed? I don't know about that one. At least one of our projected powerhouses might fall here. The Celtics. Oh, no, nah, they didn't just lose. They didn't just lose. They got dusted in game seven. Oh, my word. And the Pacers are just... Is that Danny Granger pouring it on? I'm making a projection. I, I think they beat these Lakers. Yeah. And this is game five with the Lakers on the brink. The Kings are up 3-1. Don't choke this now, Sacktown. Do not choke this, Oscar. You're up five. Sacramento, don't choke. Natani. <gasps> Wide open. Wayne Embry. A legend. Wayne! The Lakers need a three. Oh, that's a beautiful look for KD. That's... He choked. And they keep going to KD. Okay, KD, you're actually... Oh, KD, you're actually waste. Durant shot five for 13. One of nine in an elimination game. Yeah, that man is not making it back to his flight at LAX. Okay, conference finals. Are the Spurs finally about to deliver on all the hype around them? They don't have Duncan and they have Richie Guerin in the starting lineup. Meanwhile, in the East, this is what I'm talking about. LeBron, D-Rose, D-Wade, Kevin Garnett, and Alonzo Mourning versus MJ Pippen Wilton. And uh, yeah, wow. They got some insane top end talent there in Chicago. Wow. Are the Spurs really about to go down three? One? Are they about to lose in five? Ga they did. Game seven. This is what it's all about. And looks like we can finally settle the whole MJ LeBron debate. Are you serious, LeBron? Bro, this battle of jerseys, these throwback heat versus the Bulls. Very sexy, if I may say so. Oh, LeBron. Okay, uh, oh, you just break that. All right. LeBron, KD, you're both waste. What, what are we doing here? The Bulls were originally the one seed in the East. The uh, Kings were a four seed. This is a very interesting finals matchup. For reference. MJ will Shaq off the bench and uh, Scotty Pippen leading this Bulls team. I would say the Kings have a bit more depth. I mean, Oscar, Kawhi, Wayne Embry's a 93. They got some studs on this team, even DeMarcus Cousins. I was worried there. I was nervous for MJ and the Bulls, but it is a series. Come on, Big O. It's not over yet. You can win MVP and finals MVP. You just got to clutch up. Michael Jordan is not even on the floor for the Chicago Bulls. This is your time, Big O. You're going in the post against Scotty. Didn't he win DPO? Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh-oh, they're big people plan work. No, it didn't. Jerry Lucas, great double team. Wilt had a mismatch, but he fumbled the bag and Big O is clutching up. No, no good defense. Yes, Lucas, jump, jump. Oh, horrible possession. Grab board, grab board. What? CJ Armstrong with the greatest shot of his life. This is it. Kawhi Leonard taking the range. Oh, you had a midi, Kawhi. What are you... What is that? What is that? Garbage. Year two, it is the Chicago Bulls winning the championship. Not that surprising, I guess. And it's a uh, Wilt Chamberlain. I can't keep track of which Wilt has won. I think this Wilt has won an MVP and a finals MVP now. Over the offseason, the champs got better with Kyrie Irving now in tow. 94 overall. LeBron has built a super team in Cleveland. Luka, Jason Kidd, Hakeem Olajuwon, DeMar DeRozan. Uh, these Celtics are bringing in nobody new other than Pete Maravich, but they still look studly. The Knicks are trying once again 
again to run it back with more star power. David Robinson now joining the crew. Oh, the Rockets. Are they a player? Vince Carter, Prime, Moses Malone. They could do some damage. Once again, the NBA looks insane heading into our third and final season with these all-time teams. The Rockets, the projected ones. I don't even... I think at this point, I know this page doesn't mean anything, right? And in year three, Oscar goes back to back as MVP. Wow. Victor Wembanyama. Wait a minute. Rookie of the... Did he just not play? He must have been sitting, riding the pine in his first year. Okay, Victor. Luca, six man of the year. I knew the Cavs would be trouble. And Victor also won DPOI. What in the world, New Jersey? Oh, shout out to Mello at La Mello. By the way, most improved player. Oscar Russell Westbrook, first team All NBA. LeBron Barry. Okay. Bill Walton, Vince Carter. Interesting. Reggie Miller. He is a stud in this. Bro, Victor Wembignana just killed it. Julius Irving, too. So are the Nets good? The Nets are the four seed against the Cavaliers, who I thought might be amazing. One of them's going to be out round one. Big O and the Kings looking for redemption, as are the Celtics. Is this finally their season? Bob McAdoo led the NBA in points and in rebounds. He's low-key dominating the Sim. The Clippers just suck. The Nets indeed took down Luka and LeBron. I was hoping they'd make a run, but they didn't. And the Pacers, once again, competitive, beating the 76ers. But this could be the biggest doozy. I just talked about how the Clippers suck with Bob McAdoo, but here they are, Game 7. Big O, man, you better not choke in Game 7. You're the two-time MVP. Oh my goodness, this is it. 130 to 130 in Game 7. Blake Griffin, big bucket inside for the Clippers, trying to pull off an insane upset. Oscar Robertson, the MVP, trying to make plays in the clutch. Bob McAdoo, he's saying, I should have won MVP. Big stop and board. Oh my word, Bob McAdoo and ISO. Yo, Bob McAdoo's balling out, I can't lie. Bob McAdoo defensively. Oh my word. Yo, my man Bob is saying, give me that respect, boys. He is here and he is killing oh, it. Oh, there we go. Dagger, Ray Allen. Come on now. Come on. This team has Ray Allen. I have no idea which version that is, but he just hit a dagger. I don't care if it was only round one. I'm here for the Bob McAdoo supremacy. Let's go. Bob and the Clippers won round two as well. They're going up against the Lakers. Get out of the way. No, what we do care about, Bob. You got to stay alive, brother. This would be so much more fascinating with the Clippers in the finals instead of the Lakers. And and, um, yeah, I'm not even going to jump. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> like 30, 30 point win. Okay. Okay, Bob McAdoo freaking killed it. 32, 10, and 5. But it is indeed Celtics Lakers, a rematch of year one. That's too bad, bro. Honestly, I don't even care who wins the title. Bob McAdoo. Yo, look at Victor. Uh, anyways, Bob McAdoo, he was an all star all three seasons and first team all NBA, the last two in our simulation. And I was only half paying attention, but the Celtics ended up winning a two point game. The Lakers really choked there. And Boston is year three champs with Bob Cousy. Wow. Wow. Bob could take that JJ Reddick. Oscar Robertson and Wilt Chamberlain, the MVP winners in our simulation. Neither won a championship though. Lakers, Bulls, Celtics. I mean, of course, the three most winning franchises of all time. We were so close to having Bob McAdoo reign supreme over the NBA. I'm very sad that didn't happen. And you know, a whole lot of other players too, but I was mostly worried about Bob. What about you?